Good morning, brothers and sisters in Christ. The lowly servant here. Welcome to my channel. Today is November 19, 2021, Friday of the 33rd week in Ordinary Time. The Gospel said, My house shall be a house of prayer, but you have made it a den of thieves. Let's have a listen and reflect on it after. But first, The first reading is from the first book of the Maccabees. Judas and his brothers said, Now that our enemies have been crushed, let us go up to purify the sanctuary and rededicate it. So the whole army assembled, and went up to Mount Zion. Early in the morning on the twenty-fifth day of the ninth month. That is, the month of Chiself. In the year 148. They arose and offered sacrifice according to the law on the new altar of burnt offerings that they had made, on the anniversary of the day on which the Gentiles had defiled it. On that very day it was reconsecrated, with songs, harps, flutes and cymbals. All the people prostrated themselves and adored and praised heaven, who had given them success. For eight days they celebrated the dedication of the altar, and joyfully offered burnt offerings and sacrifices, of deliverance and praise. They ornamented the façade of the temple with gold crowns and shields. They repaired the gates and the priests' chambers, and furnished them with doors. There was great joy among the people, now that the disgrace of the Gentiles was removed. Then Judas and his brothers and the entire congregation of Israel decreed that the days of the dedication of the altar should be observed with joy and gladness. On the anniversary every year for eight days, from the 25th day of the month Chiself. Responsorial Psalm We praise your glorious name, O mighty God. Blessed may you be, O Lord. God of Israel our Father. From eternity to eternity. We praise your glorious name, O mighty God. Yours, O Lord, are grandeur and power. Majesty, splendor, and glory. For all in heaven and on earth is yours. We praise your glorious name, O mighty God. Yours, O Lord, is the sovereignty. You are exalted as head over all. Riches and honor are from you. We praise your glorious name, O mighty God. You have dominion over all. In your hand are power and might. It is yours to give grandeur and strength to all. We praise your glorious name, O mighty God. Alleluia, Alleluia. My sheep hear my voice, says the Lord. I know them, and they follow me. Alleluia, Alleluia. The Gospel according to Luke. Jesus entered the temple area and proceeded to drive out those who were selling things, saying to them, It is written, My house shall be a house of prayer. But you have made it a den of thieves. And every day he was teaching in the temple area. The chief priests, the scribes, and the leaders of the people, Meanwhile, were seeking to put him to death, but they could find no way to accomplish their purpose because all the people were hanging on his words. Reflections There always comes a time of great difficulty, temptation, challenge or danger in life. We may get so overwhelmed by these situations that we are tempted to lose heart. In today's reading we are encouraged to stand strong even in the face of grave danger or difficulty for so long as God is on our side, we shall always be victorious. Joshua and the army of Israel were no match in number for their adversaries, but God still gave them the victory. Jesus' adversaries south every means to destroy him but they could lay no finger on him till his destined hour. Hence we should be confident, God stands for us. That's the end of the reflection from the Catholic Missal. Subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell, so you won't miss out on my next upload. Be safe and always keep God in your hearts. Peace to all.